My name is Jenny Akita. I'm a fiber artist. I uh, create wearable and decorative fiber art using sustainable fibers as wool, silk, and flax. I add some water, soap, and hand agitate until all the fibers are tangled together and create the textiles. The process is called felting. Actually, it's one of the oldest techniques to create the textile. If you're going to go to the museum, you can see the pieces of felt that could be 3,000 years old. In felting, I found the fusion of different mediums. So when you create the sculptural aspect and uh, you can paint on top of the felt and uh, you can hand dye, you can use the natural dyes as leaves and plants. So it's a lot of the sustainability you can, you can use in felting uh, to create the art and a lot of the art aspect like a painting and the sculptural. So I use the templates, like a 3D templates. I layer the loose fibers around the template, then add water, soap, and hand agitate. And it's some sort of like, I would, I would compare it like a massage to the fibers on, on surfaces of the fibers until all the fibers are tangled and create the textile. The inspiration is coming from nature, I would say, and plants. I'm very focused on the texture and micro details. Sometimes customers, they say, they see somewhere that speaks to them. And I, I would think this is some, some sort of a non-vocal language when the uh, artists create the art, so they reflect some sort of the feelings and uh, inspiration and visual things in their art. And when people s look at the art, so when they reflect their own inner world in there as well. So it's some kind of a connection in the language between the artist and the viewer.